Welcome, I am Gabi Zapodanu, Technical Marketing Engineer, Cisco Systems Enterprise Networking Business. In this short demonstration, I will show you how using the Cisco DNA Center REST APIs, we are able to collect device information, create a report, and save it as a CSV file. This demonstration will show you how to find the API documentation on Cisco DNA Center. The sample code will obtain the Cisco DNA Center auth token, identify how many devices are managed by Cisco DNA Center, collect the desired device information, and save everything in a report as a CSV file. I will also share with you information on how to find the Cisco Enterprise Networking Programmability GitHub organization, which includes the sample code and additional information regarding our use cases and the Cisco DNA Center SDK. To find the information about the APIs that are required by this application, we need to go to Platform, Developer Toolkit, and APIs. On the left-hand side, you can find the APIs grouped based on functionality. In our case, we are looking for information regarding devices and here we have a lot of different APIs that can be used to collect information regarding the network devices that are managed by Cisco DNA Center. To execute this application, I will use PyCharm. It is the IDE that I use to write this code. We can see that we identify that we have 11 devices managed by Cisco DNA Center and a new file that has been created with the information collected for each of these devices. Looking at the file that has been created, we can identify that we have the host name of the device, the type of device. We have also the information regarding the software version, the network management IP address, and the serial number. The Cisco Enterprise Networking Programmability Organization on GitHub includes the repository for this sample code. You may be able to find here additional use cases and sample code, including the Cisco DNA Center Software Development Kit, the SDK, that is available for you. The Cisco DNA Center SDK includes information regarding how to install the SDK and how to use the SDK. In the description of this video, I included information on how to find the Cisco EN Programmability Organization on GitHub, information on how to find resources on Cisco DevNet that are dedicated to Cisco DNA Center REST APIs. Should you have any questions, please let me know and thank you for your time.